get a chance to feel one another out here in mid-September. Harold Degla now intercepts and cuts on in backhands, and Shield makes the save. Rebound to LeClaire. He fires off the post. This line of LeClaire, Gerard, and Egla going to work again. LeClaire in front for Egla in the slot. Tees up and scores! Where have we seen this before? Harold Egla setting up in the slot. LeClaire finds him, and Egla able to find the roof over the shoulder of Shield. And for the second straight game, Madison gets Seven minutes of the first before his team had a great response at the other end of the ice and gave Ryan Edquist some testers near the latter stages of the first. Puck rolls right through the reach of Kemp in the corner. LeClaire meets him with vigor. Centers it for Gerard. His shot blocked off. Second try. He scores! It was just a matter of time for Charlie Gerard as his first opportunity was blocked, but as good luck would have it, it Ernst couldn't stop it at the left point. It just rolled under Jordan's reach. Fedeyev now for Fosdick in center ice. Fosdick for Fedeyev. Fedeyev busting it all alone. He shoots. He scores! Eugene Fedeyev finding the seam right down the middle, took the feed from Fostik, and finally, Madison able to strike on the power play as the Ukrainian Fedeyev is able to beat Shield. It's 4-3. So Fedeyev has replaced him on that line. Don't really know if Fede or if Leclerc is on the bench for Madison. Haven't seen him in quite some time. Into the left wing corner it comes. Michael Pastage off trying to rip it loose. Getting thrown down to the ice was Fedeyev from behind by Cassetti. Nothing called. Through center comes the McCormick. McCormick ahead of the field. Here's Piasov. In alone. Piasov scores! Alex Piasov for the second time this weekend finds himself alone behind the D and he's able to beat Shield on the blocker side to make this a 4-4 game. The Canadian of Russian...